And we're back from our Energon break as well. Yeah, sorry guys, I had to tap out. I, I didn't know how to do this thing. So he was in this position uh, before we left for the break. And I was thinking I needed to fold this forward because this, because I was thinking this is gonna be in that position. But actually, it this doesn't fold forward. You fold this down first from here. So I was trying to fold this forward and thinking that there is a um, a tab somewhere in here behind his head that I should untab, but that's not the case. What I should really be doing and what you should really be doing is just remove this piece from that panel. There you go. And then now, and now you can swing this back. So you're not actually swinging it forward or accordioning, accordioning it forward. So next thing you need to do is, uh, so there's pegs right there and a peg right there, peg holes there and a little bit of a peg hole right there. You're just gonna have to line it up. And let's see, it's easier said than done. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to do it. Ugh, how did I do it? I, I already tried doing it and I, yeah, like I said, I looked at it. There you go. A uh, YouTube video on how to transform this thing. Um, finally figure it out. And there's a couple more things I realized about this guy. And I'll be showing you that in a little while. Meanwhile, now this one has to fold back or up depending on if you're looking at the robot mode or vehicle mode and then so we're, we I, I undid this part we're gonna do it again there you go Ooh, sorry there you go and then okay so we are we are there right now his head we actually fold his whiskers forward and then his arms actually have to fold up from the shoulder fold it all the way such that it's not an you no know, it's not pointing upward it's pointing a little bit with an ink line that way okay it helps to and, and this silver piece is facing forward still. Make sure you maybe, yeah, okay. All the way forward. So this is not enough. You have to push it one more bit. Okay, there you go. And then now we could, oops, I unfolded this. Let's fold them up again. Let's peg it into place. Peg this into place. And then we can now tab the nose together. There you go, nice snap. There you go. And this is one of the things I realized about this guy. There should be a couple of panels here. So there's a ball joint there with this little um, lever. And there's another ball joint there with the panel. I guess um, it, it you normally it comes off easily and that's why probably so the owner lost it uh, and then there should be there's a ball another ball peg here then there should have been another lever and then another panel that would have completed the look but it is what it is so that's that's where it should be so now let's uh work on the back we we know how to do this part already right so we're not going to try to do that yet let's work on the back what should happen here is, whoops. So it folds all the way back. And um, so let's just put, put these there on the back. And then what we're gonna, what we need to do is we need to fold the legs up and out like that. Fold the thigh actually, the thigh up and out a little bit. There you go. And then we're gonna spin this around 
Whoa, which way? Well, actually, I should have um, should have joined these two together first. Join that there. Fold this there and join those two. And there you go. Um, fold the back heel forward. And then join these two. And then we're going to flip this out somehow. So now um, we're going to spin them in. Oh, what's going on? So, whoa, what's going on? Okay, there you go. I think that's it. So what's going to happen is, so that's, that's the position more or less. But these things have pegs right there and there's a peg hole right there. And we're just going to peg them in. And again, keep this cable thing there. I think this one is also is for the other set of missing panels. So there should be a, some panels here. Fortunately, they're missing. So anyways, we are going now to try to have this in, as I mentioned. It's a little difficult, obviously. Nothing easy. There you go. And then peg peg hole. And if you see that, oh, it's difficult actually, but there it there it almost is. There. And then now let's just fold out these. Uh, uh, landing gear this one is also sort of uh it helps him stand basically and last but not least we're now gonna pop these in place oh there you go are you sure that's how it is yep oh jeez and so there are not how it is. that's about it yeah see very it would have been very nice if he's complete if he had this the part here and the part here and, the, and this other part yeah part unfortunately yeah we don't have those the, but otherwise it, yeah and then one of the things that i noticed about this thing is um so jetfire's head is supposedly the cockpit but it's actually a faux cockpit and the real cockpit is over there it's fine so i also learned that this guy connects to um revenge of the fallen optimus prime so there's the, he has parts that connect to that Optimus Prime. Unfortunately, we don't have that guy. Oh. But overall, there that looks large. nice, looks large. I like it a lot. Unfortunately, Me he's too. incomplete. He doesn't have his cane also, which I think provides the landing gear here, here, the front. But it is what it is. So that being said, let's turn him back into robot mode where he looks a little more complete. And to do that, the first thing we need to do is, um, well, let's actually let's work our way backwards. Let's untab these, fold them out like that. And you can fold those panels too. Be careful, Nan. No, no, Nan. Then we can uh, untab the legs from that top panel. There you go. And then fold root. Oh, Nan, be careful. Okay, rotate, fold down, rotate, um, rotate, fold down, rotate, and then this one is just gonna so unfold that out. Actually, yeah, Ooh, wait a minute, not yet. Pop this. So, wait a minute, what happens here? We need to, oh, this one, inside part, pop that out first, inside, pop that out, and unfold the back heels, and then these will fold into place, this will fold back into place, and then these will fold backwards to the side, and then here, um, we're almost ready. We just need to oh let's let's untap his two arms first. Ooh, this one's difficult. It snaps 
on pretty nicely but it, it's difficult to unsnap so anyway there it is then we'll fold out the arms okay and then we're just gonna fold these back untab and fold it back i think it should tab into place also somehow and then now we could untab this part from that panel fold it forward and then we are going to push this up accordion it up pop that in there Oops, sorry in there and then we have um peg peg holes no well these two pegs two peg holes and once you do that there will be a sound and then okay Whiskers. oh we have to zoom out now i think it's gonna look like that fold down his arms he's got nice well just articulation on his three on three fingers yeah. Not, not on his thumb, thumb, but just on his three fingers, which is fine. Yeah, I'd say it's okay because it's because it's not a masterpiece. So yeah. you could because masterpieces you would expect that. Oh, okay. Okay, it will look something like that. We need to start zooming out now. There we go. He's almost there. Just need to get the panels out of the way. Basically, the panels on his back. Ooh, that one goes there. Oh, how do I pop that in? Oh, there you go. That's a whole lot better. Okay. This thing just needs to pop in there. Last piece of the puzzle. We need to bring these panels down. Untap that one. Actually, this is how it is. And uh, this one was supposed to fold. Oh, sorry. This one was supposed to fold in there with the panel it came with, but you don't have that panel this one just lifts up a little bit and last but not least fold this down leave them like that fold these down leave them like that and there he is so unfortunately we don't have a cane for him but it's all good old people or people with some difficulty walking use a cane so that it's like they have three legs so and oh last thing to do of course is just push the whiskers back they're soft like rubber type thingy okay well i i think that's it Let's see if this can tab into place so i can't believe it i i've always wanted a jet fire and now the dreams come true yeah oh there you go it taps into place so there's a peg right there and a peg hole right there you can line it up somehow so that it won't flop down too much so there you go again he looks very nice i like it a lot my name is jetfire what's your name and then what's his other oh yeah that's what happens that's when you push this down 
Yeah, baby. Jetfire is my name. Jetfire. Well, that's about it for this episode. Took us about 30 minutes and a tap out to get this done. Uh, we hope you liked this episode. If you did, hey, he looks like Batman here. Some kind of bad object. Even his collars are like that. But um, if you like this episode, we hope we hope you like you like this episode. And if you did, please don't forget to click like, please comment, and please subscribe. And last but not least, please share this video with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and everybody you know. Including your enemies, because you might start to like you again. And until next time. Jetfire is my name. Why don't you do the... You mean... This one? If I can find it? Where is it? Whoa, where is it? How do I do it? I forgot how. Oh, man. Oh, it's hidden. There you go. Until next time, Autobots, rev up and rule out.